WWF is interested in being here to uh, to see the last ice area. The last ice area has been uh, established in uh, ice models as an area where you'll have sea ice, summer sea ice in 30 years from now. And this might be a crucial habitat for, for polar bears and other ice dependent species. This is also an area where you see new development, new shipping routes, new development of oil and gas. And, and that's, that's why we, we take an interest in this area. Uh, our main goal is to, to have a discussion about the future of this area and management of this area to the benefit of, of nature. My crew for the for the first leg, uh, traveling from Banavik to to Ranak in Greenland, is uh, Sasha Schut. She is a student from from Greenland. She studies biology, and she's here to help me do outreach. Uh, Sasha speaks Greenlandic too, uh, and she's here to help me when we go into the communities to talk to people and teach kids about nature and why nature and nature conservation is important. On board we also have uh, Torsten Milsen, he's a, a wildlife photographer from, from Germany and Torsten is, is documenting our trip, taking all the nice pictures for us. And finally we have Tim Dawson who is uh, doing work on, on salt sea marshes and right now he's looking at a salt sea marsh in Ubernavik, which is, he was just telling us on board that this might be the furthest north that someone has looked for salt sea marsh areas in, in Greenland. So he was very keen to come here. It goes directly from the green and the red, like grass there. It goes from that to a lot of this. Uh, personally, I'm looking very much forward to going to Ranak. Uh, my, my hope is that we'll have the time to, to visit Siwrabaluk, which is the most northern settlement in, in Greenland. There's 68 people living up there, uh, and it's, it's a hunter community. And, I'd, I'd really like to go up and see that, and, and Mount Dundas too, but uh, see Rabeluk mostly. And then I hope that we'll see whales, and I hope and pray that we might see a polar bear too. That would be incredible.